Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope y'all are having a great day so far and thank you so much for being here and hanging out with me for just a little bit. Today's video is a super, super motivating clean with me and I'll also be sharing with you some new products that I'm pretty excited about. I hope this video gets you guys up and motivated to clean along with me and just tackle your day. But before we get too far into it, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also hit that little red subscribe button down below. If you're new around here, I would love to have you join my little YouTube fam. But let's get on into the cleaning. So today's video is sponsored by Toppin and I do want to just say a huge thank you to them for sending me a few products to review for you guys. The first one is this Toppin Powerful Cordless Vacuum and I've been using this one for a little over a week now and you guys it has totally totally impressed me. I'm sure most of y'all can relate but Life with Little Ones brings a ton of messes and it's super nice to be able to just quickly grab a lightweight cordless vacuum and get the job done and the suction power and battery life on this vacuum have been absolutely amazing and for the price point you really can't beat it. It comes with three attachments two of which are pretty common for cordless vacuums but the third one is an extendable attachment which you'll see me use on my couch in just a little bit and it's come in very very handy it also does come with a wall mount that holds all three attachments and the vacuum while it charges You guys look at all of the stuff that was vacuumed up just from my couch it's kind of embarrassing but hey this is real life i also wanted to let you all know that this vacuum does have three suction modes so it's perfect for picking up any of the messes around your home i'll have all of this link down in my description box there'll be a link directly to the top end website because they do sell way more than just vacuum cleaners so you should definitely check them out and i'll also have a link to the specific vacuum down there as well so if you're in the market for a cordless vacuum i would highly highly recommend this one Not a bad 
Okay, so now that I'm done in the living room, I'm going to move on into the kitchen. Does anyone else's kids just mix all of the Play-Doh all together and just make it black? And it's kind of gross, um, but I'm going to clean up this mess they have on the table and straighten up and declutter all of my countertops and do some dishes. And then we're going to vacuum in here as well. I noticed that my dishwasher was starting to smell a little bit funky so I decided to just pull out the filter really quick and clean it and I'll show you a close-up of it in just a second and it was pretty gross let me know down below how often you guys clean out your filter to your dishwasher because I obviously don't do it enough and I know I've said it on my channel before but it's just something that slips my mind so so much I am also going to start this load and run it on just a quick cycle and even though it's not full I'm doing that because it does smell kind of funky and I wanted to just kind of clean the inside of it without there being a lot of dishes to also clean This is my first time using the Mrs. Meyer surface scrub that I got for my Grove Collaborative order last week and I really did enjoy it. It wasn't anything that wowed me but it definitely shined my sink up and cleaned it really well and there was no residue left behind. Sometimes when I use a barkeeper's friend I have a residue left behind if I don't rinse it out perfectly or whatever but this did not leave any residue behind which I was really pleased with. I'm a little bit naughty. I'm a little bit too consumed But every part of my body Is telling me to run away from you Come a little bit closer Yeah, yeah Come a little bit closer Yeah You're a little bit crazy It's been days but you never change What's love got to do with it? He comes around better not that stuff down Come a little bit closer Yeah, come a little bit closer. Yeah. To all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't 
treat them right Put your finger right in his face And tell that man bye-bye I'm too fly I'm too fly Okay, so now we're on to the very next day and I wanted to start off by catching up on folding some laundry and getting that put away, making my bed and just tidying up my room. I'm scared you're gonna blow your fuse. Come a little bit closer. Yeah. I can really start over. Yeah. In the back of my mind, there's someone waiting on me. You're just wasting my time because you're scared and lonely. Finally got some closure Yeah I can finally start over Yeah To so all my ladies who got a brother That doesn't treat them right Put your finger right in his face And tell that man bye bye I'm too fly I'm too fly Bye 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 Here's to the memory to be Your friend said that you left me I'm glad that's what you believe me so all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't treat them right Put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye bye I'm too fly So now we're moving on into the boys bathroom and I wanted to just clean off this countertop really quick and then I'm also going to reorganize or declutter underneath of the sinks here because things just get thrown in there and it gets kind of messy sometimes. Toppin was also kind enough to send me this automatic hand soap dispenser, which has come in really handy for my boys. It's so easy for them to just put their hands underneath there, trigger the sensor, and get the hand soap that they need to wash their hands with. So I'm just going to quickly set this up with the batteries and then get some hand soap put into it. I did originally use the Grove Collaborative gel hand soap that I'm about to show you, but I ended up having to switch that out for the Mrs. Myers hand soap because I read further into the instructions and it says that gel hand soap doesn't work really well with the pump and it wasn't coming out, but I did switch it to the Mrs. Myers and it worked perfectly with that. I also love the design of this hand soap dispenser. I think it looks really nice on my countertops. I will also have this link down in my description box for you to check out as well. And now we're going to move on to decluttering and cleaning out underneath of the sinks in the bathroom. This first sink is where I keep all of the cleaning supplies and the trash can. So I just wanted to go ahead and empty the trash can, wipe it out, and then I'm also going to just put everything back in a little bit more organized. Yeah. 
know about you guys, but I feel like laundry is never ending in my house. There's always clothes that need to be washed, always clothes that need to be folded and put away. If you're still here watching with me, go ahead and leave me a laundry basket emoji down in the comment section. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and fold this load of laundry and get these clothes put away and that's gonna do it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this one and it gave you a ton of cleaning motivation to tackle your to-do list. Also, don't forget to check out all of the links down in my description box and all of the Topin products that they have to offer. I'm sure you guys will love them just as much as I do. Before you leave, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also hit that red subscribe button down below. If you're new around here, I would love to have you stick around and join my little YouTube fam. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and a great holiday weekend with your family. I'll catch y'all in my next video. Bye guys. Hope you feel the same.